Reaction. Welcome back to LJ Reactions. This is Leo Rap James. Now, for our last video today, we'll give you guys a Walking Dead Season 7, Episode 9, mid season premiere review of what happened. Now, first off the bat, this whole episode, I agree, it was perfect. Nothing that Carol's was... gonna die. <laughs> the fuck? Carol is gonna die. He's gonna, I'm just gonna throw that out. It's gonna jump ahead of shit. All right, go ahead. Now, what happened this episode to me? Nothing seemed boring. Nothing, but it's gonna be a slow build between till we get the king. Somebody going die next next show. That's Somebody going die. <laughs> what the fuck? I can, I can promise it's you that just, shit. You <laughs> guys trying to jump ahead? All right, to me, it's gonna it's a slow burn between until we get the kingdom, and then and then Rick and all his people. Now this so called new group that. Rick has just found in the last episode, which he was smiling at. I was like, why is Rick smiling? Yeah, Rick, Rick, I think Rick. he was just happy to find some more damn people out there, not yeah. freaking savages. They better not fuck up with these guys. <laughs> they look like a bunch of fucking savages. <laughs> God damn. Yeah. Um, to me, what was your high points of the show? Anything that you think was like bad, slow? Besides, uh, I know besides me and you, we don't Morgan's bitches. It's bitches attitude. <laughs> I mean... I don't know. It was pretty good, you know. I'm just trying to look for what's his name. Who are you looking for, Leroy? But anyways, let's for the Leroy fans what he's talking about. To me, Morgan, another bitch out moment again. I mean, after you heard that Glenn died, and after you heard what's the dude with the right uh, red hair? I forgot his name. Fuck. Fuck. See, it's why you. <laughs> That's why they killed his ass off. <laughs> what was his dude's name? There we go. Abraham. Abraham. You killed after, Abraham. After Damn. Abraham and Glenn died, right and then the fucking dome. Two more that people. Two more people died, and Morgan's so like, nope. Let's see if we can capture Negan. No, nah, ain't no capturing Negan. You didn't kill no, the dude. But what I think that Rick should have did, he should have challenged Negan in front of like all of his people. Why? So he could Good. do a face off. One on one. No face off. Yeah. Bare naked, butt naked fight. No, no face well, off. They ain't gotta be butt naked. They got, they got some drawers on. It's, it's gotta be. It's a bare knuckle fight. No. Face I, off. No, don't see face who, off. See who's real boss. No, because Morgan, I mean, Negan could probably still kick his ass. What? Negan could probably still kick Rick's ass. That Lucille Batman. What Rick got? I said bare knuckles. Ain't no bare with knuckles. No, with no Lucille. <laughs> Come on. You, you can think you can think Rick Rick could, would get beat down by a Negan. Yes, with no weapons. Yeah. Comment down below, people. You get think Negan would, would lose to Rick? I think Negan would beat Rick with no weapons. Yeah. Who would win in a fight? I'm still going Negan. And two, Rick Rick, Rick, is Rick not, would go all psycho on his ass like he did in the damn jail. Rick is, <laughs> Rick's killer instinct has not returned to him yet. Okay. It's not returned Keep to him on fully. Rick. It's, Keep not, on. it's not returned to him yet. I mean, it's slowly building back up, but it's not fully returned to him. I mean, come on, man. The way Deacon killed Glenn and Abraham with no fucks given. I mean, come on. No hesitation. Oh, my God. Come on. He was captured. What was he going to do? Let his kid die, too? Yeah. <laughs> Show some man balls. Fuck Rick had no balls. They had like a thousand guns pointed at him. Anyway, he had no balls. Anyways, we continue. gotta find out what the hell happened to Gabriel. That nigga took all the food and I know how, I know what happened with Gabriel, people. Everything Gabriel just took off and zooped out. That's I think what I think I Shit. think Gabriel is hiding out somewhere, waiting until the he might be you never know. Gabriel could be at the kingdom, bro. He could be at the kingdom. They would have said that. No, it wouldn't. They would have said that, man. Gabriel could be somewhere. No, no. He could be in Carol's house. No, where no, Carol's man. house Did is you at. see how they pulled up on Rick and all them? And Jesus? Yeah. Who, who the hell are you? <laughs> he could be. Horses and guns and shit? He could be at Carol's house somewhere. But it was, I don't think. I don't think no. I don't think Gabriel really just abandoned him and left off. I think he said, did. That, that nigga said, <laughs> peace. No. Peace. <laughs> I think Gabriel is somewhere, but I don't think he's like that nigga got a, abandoned him. <laughs> they got a car and a tank full of gas no. and some food. I just think Gabriel's just waiting until Rick gets with his people. Denise gets enough army that you'll see Gabriel's pop out of nowhere. Father Gabriel, where have you been? I when is Maggie going to have this baby, man? When I, Maggie needs damn. to have the baby. She's what, four months pregnant having walking there or some shit? Shit, seems like fucking forever since they did a long ass break. Uh, she probably about four months pregnant. Anyways, let's see what else happens this episode. Um Episode two. Okay. Episode two. 
What are you doing? It's episode two. Uh, no, this is what's going to happen next episode. This, we can't, we're not jumping ahead. Yeah, finish it. We got to finish the whole complete rundown all right, first. All right, fine. All right. I'll save my thoughts. A complete rundown. What's up with thoughts on that scene with them and the walkers out there by the cars? Oh, yeah. That's See? true. Yeah. <laughs> they fucking... <laughs> man. Man, them cars are so damn old. I know, right? How the fuck <laughs> they got them started up like that, man? Well, what if yeah, they keep moving back? Cool. And, what if the sabers kept moving back and forth? I guess. That completely. Uh, got still got some juice left in them. Maybe. I don't know. They look. They look. I don't know. Usually, you, you leave your car at the airport for a good while, like a month, and that shit needs to be recharged. <laughs> they got to recharge the battery. So, look. That scene. I, I like the scene. I mean. To me, Rick was like, hold the fuck on. We're not going until we get exactly what we need. <laughs> the walkers are not going to move that damn fast. And then they moved no, up on your ass. Apparently, they did. Yeah. At first, you see all a few walkers. Then you see like a hundred motherfuckers. Coming out of nowhere. God, damn. Uh, that was a great scene. I mean, to me, I was kind of like, why the hell is Rick and Michonne just suddenly escaping all these walkers around them? Like, it's nothing. <laughs> like, they're just slithering past them all. Um, who did Rick say you can make it back to the hilltop? Was that... Sasha, 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 and uh, Jesus. And they said uh, they were they went on foot, so they might they might run into Gabriel. Yeah, never. next episode. Yeah. All right. Uh, thoughts on the episode? I we each liked it. I mean, it's a great mid season premiere. It wasn't like the last one season premiere. Fucking Negan killing everybody, but it was a good mid season premiere. Uh, so, what's your thoughts on the next episode where the people that Rick's met? They, I think there's a challenge they have to do. They have to fight for the life. Yeah, it looks like they got to do a challenge to prove themselves. It looks like they got this, like, boss zombie. <laughs> <laughs> you got to kill each one. You got to kill this zombie. <laughs> <laughs> Many have tried. <laughs> few, yeah. few have come out. Now, also, with Daryl staying at the kingdom, he has to convince King Ezekiel to lend him some of his men. Do you think that's going to fast track it or do you think he's gonna agree I think King Ezekiel's still gonna be a little bitch <laughs> <laughs> he's still he's been playing all those people like like he's a real king or something but he's just a zookeeper just happens to have a fucking tiger <laughs> you know yeah me great episode um like comment subscribe don't forget to hit the notification button up there so you know when we upload our videos will be uploaded to YouTube don't forget, forget to subscribe and comment down below on your thoughts do you think Rick would lose to Negan in a one-on-one boxing match like Floyd's going to beat Conor McGregor when they fight? No, this is <laughs> it's not a boxing match. This is bare knuckles, no weapons, hand-to-hand combat. Hand-to-hand combat? Yeah. All right, guys, we'll catch you guys again on Sunday. Yeah. And also thank Chris Local for the fresh haircut. Thank for the haircut. And Lear's going to shave his sometime today, it looks like it. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. So Shit, cat- you're back like a motherfucker. Yeah, mine's also two weeks also. So catch you guys on Sunday. Don't forget to send us some re- subscribers requests what you want us to react to and be right to you guys on Sunday. And what y'all want us to review? If y'all have any questions for us, just let us know. 100 subscribers, people. All right. On the way to 1,000.